that I Ching. There are many possible translations of the book's title. Thou literally means, way, or one of its synonyms, but was extended to mean, the way. This term, which was variously used by other Chinese philosophers, including Confucius, Mencius, Mozi, and Nfizi, has special meaning within the context of Taoism, where it implies the essential, unnameable process of the universe. T basically means, virtue, in the sense of, personal character, inner strength, or integrity. The semantics of this Chinese word resemble English virtue, which developed from a sense of inner potency, or divine power, to the modern meaning of moral excellence, or goodness. Qing as it is used here means canon, great book, or classic. Thus, that I Ching can be translated as the great book of the way and the virtue. 1. The Tao that can be told is not the eternal Tao. The name that can be named is not the eternal name. The unnameable is the eternally real. Naming is the origin of all particular things. Free from desire, you'll realize the mystery. Caught in desire, you see only the manifestations. Yet mystery and manifestation series from the same source. This source is called darkness. Darkness within darkness. The gateway to all understanding. That teaching by old master Lao Coming soon.